Hello, Mr. Bear. Bray just wanted to send you a gift for uh, hooking out with the delivery the other day. It uh, just came into stop last week, and I thought you may appreciate the little taste of the whole month. Alright guys, today we're going to be checking out the SR2M Varesk submachine gun, the newest gun added in at this escape from Tarkov with the latest wipe, firing 9x21 rounds. It's the next iteration of the shrimp pistol, which hopefully actually means that we're going to get the SR3 next time. So yeah, this gun is a lot of fun. Um, you can put a suppressor on it, you can do a couple things with it that I'm going to show you in a second. But yeah, it's, it's very, very fun, and in my opinion, it really does fill the gap between going from like a UMP to an MP7. Uh, the way I view it is like your, your MP5, your PP19, that's sort of your base level SMGs, and then you move up to a UMP. Uh, but the UMP kind of had a bit of a fall off when you, when you start wanting to go uh, for the AP rounds. They're very inaccessible for lack of a better word. Um, and then the next step up from the UMP was to go to the MP7. Um, and that's quite a big jump. So to get like a fully modded UMP, uh, you, you're looking at maybe like a hundred grand, like it's not much. Uh, but then to go to a fully modded MP7, you're looking at a hundred grand just for the suppressor. Uh, the magazines are fairly expensive as well. So this, this SMG really does fill that gap quite nicely, in my opinion. And yeah, let's let's check out what you can actually do with it. All right, so we've got some stuff here. I uh, got suppressor, some sights, all the ammos, the mags, and and stuff. So the way this comes, you can buy it from Prapper at level three. Uh, it comes just like this, with 85 ergo and 46 recoil. It comes with a little hand stopper on the front there. You can actually take that off and you can you can put this suppressor on here and you can buy that from Prapper at level 3 as well. So you can take that off and you can put the suppressor on. And you might have noticed there that actually taking the handguard hand stop off uh, makes the gun unusable. So you can't actually take it off in raid. Same goes for the suppressor. But generally if you were to, uh, to loot one of these and it was suppressed, you can't actually take the suppressor off, so it's going to be at most a, at at least a six slot gun. And so it also comes by default with this little short side rail here. Uh, so you can put a laser straight on it if you wanted, just like that. Also comes with this dust cover that has a little rail on the top of it, uh, which can mount this reflex side. So this reflex sight is unique to the SR2. Uh, you can buy it at proper level 2 as well. And you can put it straight on just like that. And it's actually a really, really solid sight. Uh, but if you didn't want that, you can actually take that off and you can buy this little mount. This B17 mount from Skier. And you can put that on. And then you can put any uh, small collimator, I think they call them. Just like your standard optics. Standard red dot sort of optics like your hollows, your delta points, uh, MRS sides, things like that. And you can put that straight on just like that. Inside of that, you can also buy the 20 round mags from Prapper at level 2. You can also buy the 30 rounds from Prapper at level 3. Now, getting into the good stuff, we have four different types of ammunition PE, P, PS, and BT. P ammo is available at level 2 proper with 65 damage and 18 penetration. PE comes in with 80 damage and 15 pen. PS bumps things up a bit with 49 damage but 35 penetration. And then lastly BT with 63 damage and 39 pen. So obviously BT is going to be the round you want. However, at the start of this wipe, it was actually available from proper level 4, and because the gun was new, plenty of people wanted to try it out, and it 
pretty quickly was found out that the BT rounds in the SI2 was pretty busted. So it was removed from Prampa altogether, and now the only way to get it is from crafting in the hideout, and it's pretty expensive to do that. Requiring at least a workbench level 2, you can craft the BT rounds by use of having a hand drill and a sledgehammer as your utility items, so you'll get them back if you do this craft. 150p rounds, 2 hawk gunpowder, 3 kite gunpowder, and 2 eagle gunpowder alongside 3 screws. Now this craft uh, on, it, on its own actually takes 14 hours and 45 minutes and you only get 150 BT rounds. Uh, that's it. <laughs> and, if, and if you actually take a look at like how many rounds you're going to need for a single raid, 150 isn't enough if the SR2 is your primary gun. So the BT round is going to be out of reach for most players. It's a, it's a really expensive craft, you're not going to get much of it. But the PS rounds. Now, they don't do much damage, but they do have good penetration, and with the fire rate of the SR2, they become your primary round, and they are available at proper level 4. They got bumped up a level, so they were available at level 3, uh, but now they're at level 4 to fill that gap from the BT rounds being removed entirely. Now just quickly, before we jump into the gameplay, I think this gun should be moved to level 2, so you can run it with high damage rounds if you want, and move the PS rounds to level 3 so that it better fills that gap between the UMP and the MP7 as an SMG. I really do like this gun. Uh, for me it's not going to be much of an issue because I'm already proper level 4 but I would like to see more people using it because it is really really fun to use. So let's jump into a few raids and see how it performs. Let's just the scove. Didn't <laughs> hear him come back across there. So. Yep. Just full sprinted in at me. The heck? He's just... Oh yeah, yeah, he's pre-medding. He knows how <laughs> he's voice learning too, okay. They come in. I think he knows where I am. Is that metal? Holy shit, no way. <laughs> Dude, I heard that ADS. I dropped down. I went down the hole. Come on, push me. Doesn't want to do that, fair enough. I wouldn't either. Got to do that audio. Oh, hey, I thought he was above me still. The G36? Cool. Dreaded that, Kurand. Bit of a fight going on still. Most people had already died with the amount of gunshots earlier. Ooh, lead X. Oh, yeah. Hey, a thermoscope. We could do uh, that task in one go. Holy shit. Shit, thank god that guy had his flashlight on, because I had no idea he was coming. I think 
That's a bit far for the SR2. Gonna close this gap. There's one, there's another one. Oh shit. It's holding the angle. What a play! Okay, okay. <laughs> Did not expect him to be sitting there like that. Player scabs, man. It's like five minutes in. Player scabs. Oh yeah, there's a guy in there. And in glass away. Fighting. Please go in. Yes. <laughs> Alright. Hopefully. Oh man, thank god I saw that laser. Dude, what's with these guys running around with shotguns all the time? He's on the staircase. Oh, dude, my leg. Yeah, he's in the bathroom. Come on, fella. Oh, just run a bus. Maybe a grenade? If I can land it? <laughs> no, bad nade. God, very bad nade. Let's go. Dude, SR2 lobby wipe. Yeah, fuck yeah. Oh, that's at least two. Oh god, get in the doorway, dude. One above. It sounds like that guy's my level, yeah? Oh! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, that guy scared the crap out of me. There's one... On the stairs, I think that that flashlight. Dude, what are they doing? Jumping around? Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's what they're doing. They're jumping in the back window. I should have brought more mags. I know I'm doing some sniping. Oh. Fuck, dude, I just saw him on the staircase as he, as he shot. <laughs> Man, I missed like every single shot. Go. How'd you run? Wait. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I what? I never heard him go pro. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> oh, I Oh, okay, man. I thought he was a cheater there for a sec. Maybe it's one of these guys scamming back in. There's no way I can trust this guy. Yo, buddy, talk to me, man. Okay, fella. It's, it's not gonna happen. 
Can't trust you, I thought I'd just kill all he is. Yeah, he had looted the other guy. There's a guy right there. Now Kobe this grenade. Ignite throw. Well, it looks good. Well, it was pretty good, but <laughs> didn't quite get the distance. This looks a bit better. Either got him or he's moved off. Yeah, he would have stayed there. He's moved off. He didn't move far. <laughs> Dude, that prone, like, stand up noise scared the shit out of me. Far out. Fuck off today. Yeah, there is someone here. Oh. What was that? Jeez, that took me way too long to figure out where he was. It's a guy right there. Oh yeah, it's PMC. Hey, that's him looting. <laughs> what the fuck? Shit. Oh man, I've been so lucky. That's just the scav. Go away. Feel safe. Safe and cozy in my little little hut. Oh! Oh my god! I, I think that was pretty accurate. <laughs> I couldn't see anything with that. Blade of grass. I, I reckon he's dead. Uh, dude, if he wasn't dead, he'd be moving and shooting. Just shredding. Bat fingered the friggin' prone button. Oh, yeah, he's dead. Okay, go. Go, go, go. Yeah, I wonder if I got him with the SR2 or with the. with the nade. Had to have got him with the SR2. He would have moved otherwise. Cultus. Oh, I have no energy. Shit. Eat that food that brought in. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a PMC. Let's just get him cultist. The cultist lost. <laughs> Let's go! What is this? What the f- 